Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. A lot of you guys have been asking me recently how I do my nails and for like a nail tutorial. So I decided this would be like the perfect video to show you guys because I was just deciding to do my nails um, and like how I do them at home and stuff. I've never done like a tutorial like this before. So sorry if it's like not the best. First, I'm gonna look for inspo. I have my whole, like this is all filled to the room with um, gel nail polish you can probably get this off like amazon and i got like this and then this also to cure it like, everything from this video is from amazon so first what i do i just cut and file my nails down like all the way oh they've gotten so long so it's kind of sad to cut them but like i use this tweezerman nail file but yeah also if i forget to say this um when i'm done filing them i file down the top too so the surface of my nail is very like rigid like really like rough and that really just helps the glue and the actual press on stick better i want to get like cuticle stuff because my cuticles like i need to get rid of them because i heard that um once you like uh push your cuticles back or whatever it uh helps the nail stay on even longer um do your cuticles because trust me like it actually helps so much like these are my nails after sorry a little spoiler but when i finish this like my nails in the video they kind of look like this i know you like can't really tell the big difference on camera but you can see it kind of looks grown out and like it just looks really bad when i did my cuticles like these two versus this hello there is a difference and no this one's not this one's not just outgrown so when i tell you like half these nails fell off like these two fell off in like a week because i didn't do my cuticles and now i did my cuticles i use this wait i use this blue cross cuticle remover i got on amazon along with these little tools so, so first i go in with this and i put it on a q-tip and i kind of like like rub it around all my cuticle then when the cuticle soft i use this tool from this set to push the cuticle back and once the cuticle is back and just cut the cuticle off that actually like I did that to a few of my nails, like these two. They're not going anywhere. Like I, the amount of times I like bang my hand or like nail against stuff today, and my it like hurt obviously, but my nail did not come off because I guess when you don't have your cuticles, you can actually like press it to the base of the nail. Um, but yeah, that's my advice, guys. Do your cuticles. Not only does it look better, it also stays on longer, and it just like looks a hundred times better. Like rust. I'm just gonna do a very simple design like that um for my actual nail color i picked out this it's kind of like a tan shade like my skin so it's for the actual like nail okay low key might go with this blue well, like a lighter blue because i feel like that's more spring and just like cuter so yeah and also for my brushes i got this back off amazon uh i use this it's called super nail glue so it's like super glue for your nails um and i use these or these okay guys, so now okay, i just put some on the actual nail and then i put some on my nail then i push those two together make sure it like goes down and get all the air out of it kind of like that i kind of like made it look outgrown sorry that was not a good example you just gotta really like press down so it lasts like so it sticks so yeah i'll show you guys again put some on here put some on my actual nail and i quickly before it dries oh my, um oh my god it, that was so crooked okay also as i go like sometimes it has like this little sharp like pointy part like right there so i just file that down and also sometimes like if I want like a different shape or like if I want them shorter, I'll also like file them to the shape I want. Okay guys, I finished both my nails. Um, now I'm gonna 
go in with okay. this. This came with like all the gel polishes. It came with the base coat and top coat. So I'm gonna do this base coat, cure it for like, I usually do always like 60 seconds. Um, I also wear these like UV gloves to help from like skin cancer. Or whatever. And then after this is cured, I'll go in with this over probably two coats. I finished the first part and this is like my favorite part of doing my nails like I low-key just want to leave my nails like this it's my it's my favorite like I love when they're like this but I just feel like it's kind of I don't know really basic and I already had my inspo but now I'm gonna go in with this blue and like a few random like tools and like little brushes to try to help me get the French tip because I'm not good at that I kind of draw the outline first um and then I fill it in. Look at that. Just like outline. Like that. And I always do a little further up than usual. Just in case I mess up. I can like you know, you can always go lower, but you can't always like erase it if you go too low. Fill what I got in. And work my way down the nail. I feel like French tips are such an easy and like nice design to like actually know how to do. since i started but i'm done i did top coat too and this is what they're looking like loki kind of ate they turned out so nice and it was so late i'm gonna go to bed thank you guys for watching i love you guys so much bye <laughs>